life than pool. Play pool, play pool. Hello, it's time to play some pool. Okay. Taking off my cardigan. Because I get warmer when I play pool. So I take off my cardigan before. And I it is very cold in, in, in my home because I have shut off the, the radiators. The radiators are shut off. And I just compensate for that by dressing warmer. You know, it is it is common sense here. You can save you can save a lot of money when you turn down the heat. Dress warmer. It is the same thing. It's the same thing. And you save a lot of money. Okay? So I have been selling stuff, so that is why I have a cloth here to take pictures on. So I, I, I always use this cloth, uh, this uh, table, table cloth to put, put my put stuff on and take pictures. And I want to fold it very nicely so it doesn't get wrinkled. Very dark here in the winter. I can never make a good video in the winter. Oh, always too dark. It is like one hour per day sunlight and already gone. <laughs> okay, so I, I will do this anyway. Need to make some videos. Need to make some videos anyway. Even when it's bad conditions. Yeah. So yeah. I have some stuff on the, on the floor here, so I hope I don't trip and fall. Trip and fall. So it was a long time since I made a combination uh, run out. I have been I have been playing I have been playing with my new cue uh, without any difficult runouts, okay? So this this is my mystery cue. Have you have you guessed yet have you guessed yet what cue this is? It is not a pool cue. It is not a pool cue. And I will give you another hint. It is not a snooker cue. Not a pool cue, not a snooker cue. What is the cue? What is the Q? I think many, many of you know it uh, by now, what Q this is. It is shorter also. So when I started the first time I played with this, because it is shorter, so I chalked in the air, because I was used to ch chalking a longer Q, so I, with this Q I just chalked in the air. Very difficult to get used to a shorter Q, but I have done it uh, Eventually, and at first, at first, I started gripping uh, too far forwards on the cue because it is shorter. So I had to adju adjust a lot of things in my game to get used to this new cue. So I have been playing just easy, easy racks, no problems on the table, easy racks. In the beginning, I missed every shot, <laughs> like you always do with the new cue. You always miss every shot. And the beginner mistake is that uh, you go to a tournament with your new cue. <laughs> I did that in the past. I lost. I lost badly when I got my first Meucci cue. I lost. So, like you can, you can, you can never believe how bad I played. And the, the tournament before that, I, I won the tournament with my previous cue. And then I got my expensive Meucci cue. I lost every tournament after that because of a new queue and it will take many months to get used to a new queue. You, you already know that. There is a, one exception to that rule. House queue. When I switched from predator, predator to house queue, I didn't miss a ball the entire tournament. That is how good house queue is. Maybe I missed one or a couple balls, but house queue, I, I won every match Maybe a, a little exaggeration there. Maybe I missed them many more times than I remember, but the, that shows the power of the house cue. With the house cue, I just, I was in stroke. I was in stroke from the first shot. I ran the rack from the first shot, won the entire tournament with the house cue. So 
house view is really good. So I'm, I'm going to show you. This is my house view, and you can I guess I can uh, you can see the length. Can you see the length here? So you see this is a. Yeah, you see that the house queue is longer than my new queue. Like this, this, this much, this much uh, shorter is my new queue compared to my house queue. And I'm using this uh, plastic uh, for, fork thing on, on the end of my house queue. So I, I have a mechanical bridge. Huh? I haven't had a mechanical bridge for for the for my entire life, but now I have, and I'm, I'm getting, I'm learning how to use it right now, like a beginner, like a beginner. So this queue, actually, I selected the cheapest queue available, and I'm 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 just going to reveal it to you, okay? It is a Karam queue for caroms three cushion billiards that is the that is the cue i have right now buffalo buffalo is the brand i don't remember the brand the, the model i don't care about that i just got the cheapest they had on sale uh, i will open up to show you how it looks like And you see here, this one has a wooden pin, a wooden pin. You see that? Wooden pin. I wanted to get uh, the hit that is closest, as close as possible to a house queue. So I got a caram queue with a wooden pin because I haven't found any pool queues with a wooden pin. And also, I need a shorter queue in my room because otherwise the wall, the wall will, hi will hit the queue uh, behind me when I stroke. So that is the bonus of having a shorter queue. So that is why, why the carom queue is perfect for me. And uh, overall, they are about equal performance, the house queue and this uh, carom queue. But since I need the uh, a shorter queue, I will get uh, an improvement on those shots near the rail. So if 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 my uh, playing room was uh, if my if my room was uh, big, very big, then I wouldn't need to have a shorter queue, and then I would keep using my house queue. But because of this reason. I need to screw it exactly the optimal amount, so I need to focus. I don't want to too tight, to, not too loose. Ah, I, I, my, my glove got stuck inside. Ah. You see here, glove is stuck inside the queue. Oof. O OCD is what you see now. OCD when screwing the queue to get right. I want it to be perfect. Perfect. Now it is perfect. Perfect amount of pressure of the joint. Not too loose, not too tight. Okay. So. This is a very, very, very nice, very nice queue. Uh, overall, overall the same as the house queue. Okay, but but since uh, since uh, I need uh, a shorter queue where I play in my in my room, because look look here, even with this even with this uh, shorter queue, I hit the wall. I hit the wall here. You see. It goes, the queue goes all the way here, even, even with this shorter queue. And with the house queue, it was much worse than that. It was going here. It was going like that. 
And as you can see, uh, you get an improvement with the shorter queue. That is why I bought this Buffalo Carom queue. And also, you can unscrew it and take it to the pool hall. I have planned for the future. I, had, I have opened up a future possibility to do that. To be able to go to a pool tournament whenever, whenever I want, if there's an occasion coming. So instead of having to carry a, a house queue, a one-piece house queue, very difficult to do that, especially in the airplane. Very difficult to do that, but the, if you can unscrew your queue, much easier. Life becomes life becomes easier if you can unscrew your queue. And so far, comparing to the house queue, it is about the same af after I got used to it. But in the beginning, this queue was much worse than the house queue. And uh, now I, I have used it for a for a while. For a long time and for many weeks i don't remember how many for a few weeks and uh, this queue is much better than predator when i used predator for a couple of years this queue is much better and it is a carom queue so this car carom queue is much better than predator okay uh, and this is this is actually the second best queue i have ever had i have ever owned second best queue in the world is this one House Q, House Q, House Q is number one. Uh, this Caram Q is number two, and uh, they are about equal. I would say equal overall in my room because my room is too small and this Q is shorter, so it it will give a little uh, little bonus when I when I'm shooting near the rail. So overall the same performance. So I, I'm going to keep using this queue instead of moving back to the house queue. Okay, so that's the only reason here. Okay, so whew, <laughs> 12 minutes, I haven't even started shooting. <laughs> so yeah, let's make something like this. So I'm, I'm using a I'm using, I had to change my technique when I switched the queue. I had to completely change my technique when switching into this queue because um, I was, I was not getting speed. I was not getting enough velocity when I shot the cue ball. So I had to change the technique for, for this queue. And that's because if you have a two, two piece queue, then energy is lost uh, through the joint. You lose energy compared to a one-piece cue. So the, it is only a very little bit with this wooden joint. Much, much bigger effect with, with a metal joint. It will remove energy. So that's not good. So I will talk more about, in the, about that in the future, about my new technique, but... Uh, I need to use, oof, what was that? I need to use, uh, I need to use quicker, quicker strokes because, because I get less energy uh, from, from the hit. I get less energy, so I need to use quicker stroke, quicker strokes. Not, not uh, slow and smooth like with the house cue, I need to use quicker strokes. So that is why I'm using a, a combination of the Stephen Hendry stroke and the master stroke so i'm using both in the same when i play i use i use both the stephen henry stroke for uh, soft to medium speed and the master stroke from medium to hard speeds and also uh, from hard to very hard i use the continuous stroke so i'm, I'm actually using three three, three different uh, techniques when i play okay Let's, let's continue here. Okay. Yeah, that was a Stephen Henry stroke. I, I still need to use, here I use the magic bridge. Yeah. Inside spin. Cheating the pocket. Oof. <laughs> that was close. I'm shooting very soft now. 
so I do, do these uh, quick strokes because, uh, because of the new cue. So I need extra speed because, because uh, the, the joint reduces velocity on the in impact. Impact. This is a funny, funny shot here. He, here I use uh, uh, master stroke or maybe the continuous stroke because I need to shoot hard. So no pauses here in the stroke. Woof, yeah. That is uh, almost good, almost. Yeah, here I, may, I will make it into, ah, I have my light behind me in the way. Yeah, that was the Stephen Henry stroke. Stephen Henry stroke. Ah, I, this is a difficult, difficult position because I, I will have a long shot on the eight there. Long shot on the eight. I, oh, I hit my foot. I have so much stuff behind me. Here I will use the master stroke. Master stroke. Yeah, that was the master stroke. Shorter and shorter strokes for both uh, speed control and accuracy. Here I have a long shot. Uh, I'm going to use the master stroke here. Secret grip for draw shots. Yeah! Woo! It's going very good, very good now. First shot of the, of the day. Here is the Stephen Henry stroke. Yep, there you go. There you go, I'm clapping for myself. For positive energy. Positive energy. Yeah, so I got a little warm from playing. I don't need, I don't need. I don't need this cardigan when I play pool. I got warm from going, from walking around the table. And that's a very good trick you can do if you are playing at home. You want to save some money. If you feel cold, go and play pool. Turn down, turn down the radiator. It will get colder inside. But then when you go out, when you go and play pool, you get warmer from walking around the table. So that is a very good ad advice here. So actually in the winter I play a lot more than in the summer because I want to get warm. I'm freezing inside, I want to get warm so I play more pool. Okay. So this is the end of the video. Until next time, goodbye. There's nothing else in life than pool. Play pool, play pool.